the Guinness Handicap Chase is next. This is a two and a half mile naught to one forty. And pretty big feel for this one as the rain comes down again. Top one is the Killer Queen for Joshua Sutherland. Under his eye, Ryan Tamasevi, Confessions of an Assassin, Paul Rhodes, Agi Osionis, Rentis for Darren Thompson, Cypress Hill, David Robertson, Word is my Bond Super Martin, Lee, them overcome Scimitar, Alex Cherry, Band of Gold. Graham Clutterbuck, Tabloid Lover, Leon Van Rensburg, Shining Bright, Craig Beckwith, Lexington Heels, Vinnie Gerard, Lusos Bend, or James Shea, First Prize, Ryan Tanasevi, Estelina Cabs, James Shea, Kyle Rear on a three-timer for Thomas Rogers, Fon Tar for David Hooley, Jenny Jingle for Thomas Rogers, and Jardine's Lookout for Graham Clutterbuck. So, 18 of them then. And calling and away. And making their way towards the first of the fences, then through the Rain and Confessions of an Assassin is the first to show as they get to the first of the 13. And they're all safely over it with Word is My Bond Super also up there disputing the lead. Tabloid Lover as well in third and under his eye on the outside as well. With Shining Bright down on his near side. They're pretty tightly packed and it would seem nothing's all that keen to lead as they get to that ditch. Which they've all gone over and now Tabloid Lover has been left in the lead. And you don't see many Leon van Rensburg front runners so... I'm sure that this one really wants to be in the lead, but it's clear by about four lengths at the moment to Lexington Heels and Overcome Scimitar and a whole bunch of them really tightly grouped as they make their way towards the third of the fences and then Tabloid Lover is clear by five lengths. But he's Overcome Scimitar and the Orange Sleeves probably just second as they get to the third. And they're all safely over that one. Jardine's Lookout is now third. Lexington Heels is fourth. And then Confessions of an Assassin, Fon Tarft after that one, Shining Bright. He's also still nicely placed. And they're running past the stands then, and they've got another circuit to go. And Tabloid Lover is five lengths clear of Jardine's Lookout in second. Well, is my Bond Super on the outside, is just third with Lexington Heels on his inside fourth. Then down on this near side is Overcome Scimitar. Behind that one is Confessions of an Assassin as they take number four. Really good jump there by Shining Bright. And also Estelina Caps both jump that really well. Just in behind them is the Killer Queen, Fon Tarf. The Grey is also nicely placed and Band of Gold is quite wide on the track with Jenny Jingle. As they take number five, and they're all over that one okay. And the field is all still standing on its feet with Tabloid Lover. Possibly a surprise leader by six lengths to Jardine's lookout as they come into this next one. And the leader doesn't appear to mind being in the lead. He's travelling nicely and jumping well. And he's probably seven lengths clear now of Jardine's lookout in second. Lexington Hills in third and overcomes Scimitar fourth. He jumped that one a little bit more slowly though. And there's a faller there. It's Argiosionis Rentis that's gone. So... Sad to see that one depart the race then, and Tabloid Lover is in the lead from Jardine's Lookout in second. Then Lexington Hills is third, and overcomes Suitar fourth. Then Word is my Bond Super, and Shining Bright, the Killer Queen, is chasing that group. Then comes Lusos Bend and Confessions of an Assassin. First prizes after that, the Grey Fon Tarf has dropped back a little bit. Then Cypress Hill as they get over number eight, and the leader's lead is now down to little more than four from Estelina Cabs, who's made a forward move into second. Word is my Bon Super on the outside is third, then Jardine's Lookout. A wide open race this one as they take the ninth. And it's still tough. Oh, it's a crashing fall at the back there for Band of Gold. Really crashed out. Uh, that's the second one to depart the race. And under his eyes also struggling to the back as well. After that fence, maybe got interfered with a little bit. Jenny Jingles, another one that's struggling out the back as well. But it's still Tabloid Lover in the lead then. Tabloid Lover's in front from Estelina Cabs and Jardine's Lookout. Then Word is my Bond Super and then Shining Bright as they race down towards the third last fence then there. Overcomes Scimitars after that one. Confession of an Assassin's getting closer. Lexington Hills is still there. Lusos Bend and the Killer Queen are trying to get into it as well as they get over the third from home. And now all of a sudden, Tabloid Lover is being collared by Estelina Cabs. Word is my Bond Super and Confessions of an Assassin coming through the challenge as well. So to overcome Scimitar. Down towards the second last they go then. The final ditch and the leader got everyone. That's a crashing fall there. Word is my Bond Super's gone this time. And it's Tabloid Lover who's still in the lead and repelling Raiders. Confessions of an Assassin is in second. Overcomes Scimitar is third. Then Estelina Cabs as they race towards the final fence then. And it's Tabloid Lover trying to make every post a winning one. He's still two and a half lengths clear of 
of Overcome Scimitar and Confessions of an Assassin running on well known around the outside his first prize but it's Tabloid Lover who races down towards this final fence with a lead of three lengths looking like he's only going to jump it but he jumps it really slowly Confessions of an Assassin and first prize are eating up the ground there's still a furlong to go Tabloid Lover's in the lead here comes first prize racing on its own up the centre of the track it's Tabloid Lover that's holding on at the moment though he can't get closer now first prize he's beginning to get up on the outside but it's just still Tabloid Lover first prize it's close as they flash past the post the angle is very very deceptive from here you can see on this one side we're quite away in front of the post so do not be at all surprised if first prize has won that one <laughs> they're all shuffling about a bit there a few glitches in the video first prize has taken it and we do need to get those finishing angles sorted out first prize is the winner for ryan tamasebi tabloid lover unlucky in defeat for leon van rensburg was second confession to an assassin paul rose was third estelina cabs for james show fourth and the killer queen for joshua sutherland was fifth